Hello everyone, so Lorenzo asks if I can make a video showing how I put my data lover into F1 2013. And for everyone who doesn't know, the data lover is this speedometer here. And it shows uh, throttle and brake inputs, it shows the speed, gear you're into, RPM. So it's very useful, but it has here the curse and DRS bar, but it's made for F1 2012, so they don't work, so yeah. Uh, but if you put it on F1 2012, it will work. So, yeah, either way, I'm going to put this link into the description, so you click on it, and you click here, download, and you download it anywhere on your, on your computer, it doesn't really matter. So, once you do that, uh, you open it, and here is the data wire. So, you make a new folder, and again, it doesn't matter where you make it, and, opa. <laughs> Sorry, data logger. Um, it, you can name it however you want as well. But yeah, you just uh, put these files here. And this is the data logger. So once you do that, you go to documents, you go to my games, Formula One, hardware settings, and you will need this hardware settings config. So you open this with notepad, and you, you need this line. So you search for it. And when you find it, you need to make sure that IP is this one. Uh, I think you will have D-Box here, like this. So you change it to 127.0.0.1. And you make sure that extra data you have one here. You have zero, so make sure you have it on one. So you save that. I'm um, sorry. So you save that, I have it already saved, so I don't need to save, but you save it, and you go uh, to properties, and let it load, I don't know why, but when I'm recording, it just loads so slowly, but yeah, so you make it sure, uh, make sure this read-only is ticked, so if you don't make the file read-only, when you start the game, it will just change back to D-Box and zero, and it won't work, so make sure it's read-only, and you click apply and OK then. And you go back into your data logger folder. And you have this folder here, OSD. So you click on it. And you have a file here. So you copy this file. And you go back into your F1 2013 folder. Now you must paste this in your F1 2013 folder. So here is my exe of the game. And I paste it here. So I already have it, but yeah, let's just replace it. Um, and yeah, now if you want the data logger to run, you just click here and you click connect. Then you start the game and it's going to work. And if you don't want the data logger to run, so the speedometer, you don't want it there, you just don't do that. But every time you want the speedometer, you just need to click make sure it's connected. Now, if your game crashes, uh, make sure MSI Afterburner isn't running. So, I, I don't have it running. And if I do, then it doesn't work. Also, if your game crashes or the, MS, or the speed metal doesn't appear, uh, make sure that... I have sweet effects, but it doesn't really make any problem, but some versions of it do. And also what was it called, injection effects or something like that, uh, try removing that or any enable series modes, so yeah, just remove them and see if it works, and if it doesn't work, maybe you haven't done one of these steps correctly before this, so yeah, so that's it, if you have any kind of problems, just write in the comments, and that's it, goodbye.